The Supreme Court has issued a surprising 5-4 ruling in favor of black voters in a congressional redistricting case from Alabama, with two conservative justices joining liberals in rejecting a Republican-led effort to weaken a landmark voting rights law. As ABC's Devin Dwyer tells us, this is a significant ruling. The court's decision today was significant and surprising for this conservative uh, Supreme Court in a 5-4 to four ruling, Chief Justice John Roberts writing for the majority, striking down Alabama's congressional maps, which were drawn after the 2020 census, for diluting the influence of black voters. Roberts said that that map uh, violated Section 2 of the Voting Rights Act of 1965, which was meant to prevent against discrimination in result uh, on the count of race in our elections and in voting. Uh, Roberts and the majority essentially sending Alabama back to the drawing board to draw a new map with a second majority black district in that state where 27 percent of voters are black. Justice Clarence Thomas and the conservatives sharply dissenting on this issue, saying race should have no place in the drawing of election maps that race neutral alternatives need to be taken. But the bottom line here, a huge win uh, for voting rights advocates in the state of Alabama and nationally as they look to bolster the Voting Rights Act after a series of setbacks in recent years. Devin Dwyer, ABC News, Washington.